Alright. <coughs> Alright, Shalom, Shalom, Israel. This is the brother Shukat Raka coming from the prophets in Babylon camp. That's out here in Tampa, Florida. And before we move on further with this lesson, I want to give all honor and glory unto Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah Bahashim, Rachakadash, Yahweh, the Heavenly Father, who this world ignorantly calls God, which his name in the Paleo Hebrew means he is and he exists. And Yahweh Shah, the only begotten Son, who this world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, which his name in the Paleo Hebrew means he saves and he delivers. And I also want to give double honors unto the apostles and bishops of Great Millstone who teach this truth and ruleth well, man. And, you know, today I want to um, want to touch up on a lesson. You know, I kind of <laughs> I kind of did a lesson on it already, but, you know, yeah, it was kind of too graphic. So, you know, but um, let's just get, you know, I'm going to show you the video, you know. I'm just gonna get to the scripts and you know Yahweh Rot desire this lesson be edifying. But um here's the video right here. Yo! And um I can't show the rest of it, man, because you know it's too graphic for YouTube. But basically what you see in there, man, um, this guy, man, who's drunk, you know, out having a good time, you know, and he went for a swim, you know, they're in the yacht, you know, and um, basically his foot got caught in the motor, man, and, you know, you can watch the video yourself, um, you know, you can see it on my Instagram, but as you can see, though, his foot got caught in the motor, and um, he lost the foot, man. In the video, you see him bleeding out, everything, man, you know. And this was judgment, man. You know, this is this is judgment, man, because, you know, we in, we in, a, we in a, a time where, you know, a lot of prophecies going to take place, man. You know, you got all these other countries, you know, gearing up for war. You got this digital dollar, you know. You got, the, you got this U.S. dollar, so like you got this U.S. dollar, you know, that's going out of value man they trying to usher in this digital currency man you know you got you got feminists you know you got cows getting burnt up man and in the end of the the, the the bible you know the, the scriptures talk about these things man you know we got some very high prophetic times ahead of us man and you know right now you should be you know trying to seek the lord man you know trying to see what's going on man but jake all they all they know and all they want to do, man, is have fun 24-7, man. You know, which is nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with having a good time, man. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with having a good time, man. It's nothing wrong, you know, get you getting a drink, man. You know, there's nothing wrong with going out. There's nothing wrong with going out in the yacht, man. But you shouldn't be focused on that 24-7, man, especially, you know, the times we're in, man. Should be spending your time trying to get right with the Lord, man. And this was judgment. And this is um This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 32, and verse 39, man. And it says, See now that I, even I, am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and not heal. And ultimately, man, this, this man was healed, man. You know, when I was watching that video, man, like, I felt it, man. Like, that shit was scary, man. Like, can you just imagine, man, the acceleration on that motor, man? You know, you see he got, once he got stuck, everybody's like, what the, oh, shit. Like, oh, shit. You know, his foot got stuck in the motor, man. You know, when he was able to get out, man, he, had, he lost his foot, man. You know, in the video, you you see his whole f his foot was gone, man. You know, you can watch the video for yourself, man. But you know that, that was judgment, man. And you know when you know when stuff like this happens, man. And you know when when people um when people die, get shot up or whatever, or they perish, they pass away. You know, a lot of people want to say, oh, that was that was the devil, that was Satan. <laughs> man, the Lord, 
the Lord ultimately sanctions for that to happen, man. You know, you got a left hand power and a, a right hand power, man. You know, they both have to go to the remote, the Heavenly Father for authority, man. You know, and these and this stuff doesn't happen. This don't happen for no reason, man. Nobody's innocent. It's not gonna happen to you for no reason, man. You know, and it says, neither is there any that can deliver out of my hands. Right, man. When you seen the video, man, his um his foot got stuck in the motor, you know, and it's like it's like a hundred people on that fucking yacht, man. <laughs> it's like a hundred people on that yacht. And all they can say is like, oh my god, he's done. You know, they didn't bother to grab a shirt. You know. They probably called it an ambulance or something. They didn't bother to grab a shirt or anything to try to help him out, man. You know, ultimately, that was the Lord in the control of all of that, man. That that guy was in the Lord's hand, man. <laughs> the Lord wanted him out of there, man. That was judgment. The Lord ordained that. You know, the Lord predestined for that to happen, man. And, you know, that's scary, man. You know, that could happen to any one of us, man. You know, that's why you got to be circumspect, man. And like I said, man, it's, it's not all of, it's not all about having fun all the time, man. You got these spares getting amped up, man. You got these judgments going out, man. This ain't the time to be partying and bullshitting 24-7, man. You know, as a matter of fact, let me let me get that real quick. You know, it's not the time to be. This is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 7 and verse 2. It is better to go to the house of mourning than to go to the house of feasting. And, you know, our people, you know, Israel, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, man. Their mindset is just focused on feasting, man. Partying, having fun, clubbing, going out for a drink 24-7, man. That's, that's all they know. There's it, it, nothing that could go past that, man. It says, for that is the end of all men, and the living will lay it to his heart, man. And that was a prime example, man. Our people just want to party, have fun all the time, man. <laughs> and that's the reason why you go to the club. Slocky, hold on real quick. I'm going to let this go by. You know, you're doing a lot of work out here. But, um, you know, our people want to party, have fun all the time, man. And you see these, these clubs begin. You go to the club, it's getting shot up. It's fights breaking out, man. <laughs> you see this, this guy went on a yacht, man, to have a good time. This nigga lost his foot, man. Fuck, man, that's scary, man. This guy lost his foot, man. You know? But it's better to go, to go in the house of mourning, man. So, uh, you know, we can have liberty right now, man. <laughs> you could go to Walmart and grab food easily, man. You know, you could do you could do certain things, man. So while you have this liberty, man, why don't you use this time to get right, repent? You know, seeking the true living power, man. So seeking who your power is. You know, get, un get wisdom and understanding of these holy scriptures, man. Understanding, you know, the, what the true, the true living power, what, he, what he's capable of. What's the name? Who's our enemy, man? You know, because it's, it's going to be a time, man. It's going to be all our hell breaking loose, man. <laughs> it's it's going to be all our hell breaking loose, man. And not going to have liberty no more. You know, they're going to usher in this, 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 this new currency, man. This new world order. This new system, man. It's going to be famines out here. It's not going to be food out here. And these people are going to be going crazy, man. And you want to you be able to say, you know what? You know, while I had the time, while I had AC in the house, <laughs> while, I was, while I had the liberty, you know what I'm saying? You know, I, I gave it to the Lord, man. So when all, when all that hell breaks loose, man, the Lord look out for you, man. You know? So, so Yahweh is how you seek salvation, man, throughout those times. Hold on, Salakia. Yeah. You know, Yahweh is how you can hear me. But yeah, man. While you got liberty, though, you want to take use this time to repent, man. Get right, man. <laughs> you don't want to be like this guy, man. 
When that day come, all you can say, man, Lord, I was on the yacht, man. <laughs> I was on the yacht, man, partying with bitches. Drinking Casamigos and shit, man. Now he has no foot, man. You know, I actually, I advise you to watch the video yourself, man. You know, that could be any one of us, man. But it's, it's better to go to the house of mourning, man. You know? But, um... Let's grab... I have to grab this, man. Because, man, I was watching the video, man. His, his foot got caught in the motor. You had this one guy, you know, he was trying to... He, he helped him out the water. And you seen the blood coming out. And when you first... When you first seen the video... Matter of fact, let's... Let me go to the comment section. You know, let's go to the comment section. I can't show the video... But yeah, man, look, they just gonna let bruh bleed out. Wow, how do people not help? I get it. It's it's scary, but like have some compassion. Don't worry, he's all right in a stable condition. It was in my country. Looks like a motor, motor cut it off. I thought a shark. Yeah, when I first watched the video, I thought a shark got him with some shit, man. But I had to I had to I had to rewatch it a couple times, man. I didn't see no shark. And when I see when he first swim, he got stuck under the little the little section, the little area right there, which it was the where the motor was at, man. And when he got out the water, man, he had no foot. All you see was a bone and just blood everywhere, man. <laughs> it says rule number one of boating, someone should have turned the engine on. You know, it's nothing but Jake's on that damn boat, man. Ain't no better, man. Look, why is the engine on it anyway? Look, yeah, he dead. Damn, someone put something on his damn leg at least. A fucking piece of cloth so he don't die. Fuck. Yeah. Because so when this, this, when the dude has, when the dude is in the water his, and the motor got caught in it, this, you had this guy, if you watch the video, you had this guy that tried to pull him, uh, pull him out. But he, at first he tried to pull him out, but he seemed like, oh, this, he got no leg. He dropped him back in the water because he was scared, man. Cause it was like fuck. That's some scary shit, man. You know that he tried to pull. He pulled him back up, man. And all you seen was blood everywhere. He had no foot, man. The guy was running away. He damn near was running away, man. After pulling, after pulling this dude, you know that his, his motor got caught. After pulling the dude whose motor, his foot got caught in the motor, man. You know they had his shirt and everything. Just couldn't do nothing, man. And ultimately, man, he was in the hands of the Lord, man. And, you know, let, let's grab that real quick, man. This is the book of Hebrews, chapter 10 and verse 31. It is a fearful thing, a fearful thing, man, to fall into the hands of the living power. And ultimately, man, this, this God was in the hands of Yahweh Shem, Yahweh Shah, man. And it was nothing. It was it was literally nothing. A hundred of those people on that yacht could do, man. It was nothing. Those it was nothing. The Casamigos, whatever he was drinking, could do, man. It was it was the money that he had couldn't do nothing. You know, the only one, the only person that could that would have delivered him, that could, the only person that could deliver him out of that situation, man, was Yahweh Bashim Yom Shah. And the dude in the comments said that was in his country, so the dude's alright. So, you know, it's mercy, but you know, it's judgment. It was mercy at the same time, man. But yeah, that man was in the hands of living power, man. You know, once the once the most high got you in his hands, man, there's, there's nothing nobody or anything can do, man. You know, a prime example, man, when PMB Rock, um, PMB Rock got shot, man. You know, the dude was eating chicken and waffles with his girlfriend. I guess some dudes in LA tried to rob him. And he shot him, man. And as you seen in the video, man, they just got footage of him just laying on the ground bleeding, man. And it was uh, all the workers were around him. It was just standing there like, fuck, fuck. They didn't know what to do, man. You know why? The Most High had him in his hands, man. The Most High didn't want those people to help him. You know, it was nothing they could do, man. It was nothing they could do about it, man. You know, and this right here is also a prime example. When the Lord has you in his hands, man. You know, the Lord the Lord ordained this, man. The Lord put a thought in this man's mind of jumping that water, man. <laughs> the Lord put a thought in this man's mind to go left, go right. The Lord, the Lord, the Lord put us, the Lord put us, kept the spirit on those jakes to keep that motor on, man. The Lord ordained that motor to be on, man. The Lord ordered that man to go under that thing and his foot to be in there. The Lord ordained the acceleration, the speed on that motor to go a certain way. 
That's fuck. That's scary, man. That's scary, man. This is the this is the heavenly father. This is Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah. The true living power, man. This is what we're talking about. This is what he's capable of, man. And you know, be prepared to see, be prepared to see more judgments like this, man. Every week, every day, man, every second, every minute, you see judgments going out, man. And like I said, man, it's not about having a good time 24-7, man. You shit like this happens, man. You know? And these judgments, these judgments don't go out for no reason, man. You know, he ain't, he basically, the point is, he ain't serving the Lord, man. You know, so, <laughs> he ain't serving the Lord. Like, what is he doing, man? He out in the yacht, man. He's trying to be on a yacht smacking asses and getting drunk and shit, man. But um, this is the book of Zephaniah, chapter 3 and verse 5, man. It says, the just Lord, Yahweh, is in the midst thereof. He will not do iniquity, man. Every morning doeth, he bringeth his judgment to light. He faileth not, but the unjust knoweth no shame. Right, man. Lord brings judgment every day, man. You see, every day, man, you see a car accident, man. Somebody gets shot. You know, this dude's. This dude's foot got caught in the motor, man. You got you got this dude, you got this guy. He killed he killed his, his woman, man, and his, and his child. But he stabbed it, he stabbed, he stabbed his woman like like 126 times, I believe. And then the child was found dead inside of an alligator's mouth. So you've seen a lot of judgments going out, man. And he's not he's not like <laughs> these judgments are crazy, bro. These judgments are like crazy, bro. This is on some a thousand uh, a thousand ways to die type shit, man. But this is a, this gonna be a fin affinity ways to die, man. So be prepared to see more shit like this, man. You know, not just people dying though. You gonna see people. You gonna see more. You gonna see more of this, man. Dudes fucking cut off in a motor, man. Shit, man, that's scary, man. She got my foot shaking right now. No, that video had my foot shaking, man. You know? And that's why the Lord, this is why the Lord is to be feared, man. This is the true living power, man. This is what he's capable of doing, man. You know? <laughs> Let me go back to these comments, though, man. But yeah, look, bro dropped them back in. Everyone's screaming instead of helping. Lord had them in his hands, man. What the fuck is everyone doing? Be so stupid sometimes. Yeah, man. When that dude, when that dude got away from the motor, his leg, his foot was all, you know. You seen the blood in the water, man. Everybody, you heard somebody in the background say, "Yeah, he's done, man." You know, this dude is in the hands of living power, man. But yeah, man. You know, it's better to go in the house of mourning than the house of feasting, man. It's not about out partying, and getting drunk. You know, slapping bitches' asses all the time, man. <laughs> this is the time where. You should be putting on your time trying to get right with the Lord, man. But, you know, um, that's really it, man. You know, you know, your high right desire, this lesson be edifying, man. You know, if it was edifying to you, it will be edifying to the hopeful elect. And, you know, once again, before I close out, I want to give all honor and glory unto the true living power. Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Bahashim, Rechakadash. And once again, I want to give double honors unto the apostles and bishops of Great Millstone who teaches this truth and ruleth well. And with that, I'm going to say Shalom, DTA, a Bible ball soon.